hello students today we will discuss about concept from sexual reproduction in flowering plants the first concept is structure of a flower introduction flowers are the organs of sexual reproduction as they produce gametes by meiosis famous scientist linnaeus gaspard bahin gothe and d condell described flower as a modified stem though the flowers may differ in color size and arrangement the basic pattern may remains the same parts of a flower pedicel it is defined as a stalk of the flower is called a pedicel so here in this photograph see the base of the flower having long a slender portion tube like portion this is called as a stalk of the flower that is pedicel based on the pedicel the flowers are of two types they are pedicellate flowers defined as flowers with the pedicel are called pedicellate flowers examples hibiscus rose etc another type sessile flowers defined as flowers without pedicel are called sessile flowers examples acanthus saffron etc bract flowers develop in the axil of a specialized leaves called bract so here in this photograph observe the aramor movement this part is called a stem and this part of the flower is called as a pedicel or stalk of the flower this pedicel is arises from the axil of this specialized leaf it is called bract another part bracteole the small leaf like structures present on the pedicel are called bracteoles so this is the pedicel of the flower on this pedicel these leaf like structures are called bracteole sides of the flower anterior side posterior side let's define these sides anterior side the bract side of the flower is called anterior side the mother axis side of the flower is called posterior side let observe the photograph so the surface of the flower which is facing towards the bract is called anterior side the surface of the flower which is facing towards the mother axis that is a stem region is called posterior side thalamus other names of thalamus are receptacle torus thalamus is defined as 
it is a swollen apical part of the pedicel let observe in the photograph so this is the pedicel part of the flower and this region is apical region so the swollen portion of this region is called as thalamus thalamus contains node and condensed internodes from the nodes modified leaves called floral leaves or floral parts are developed floral leaves or floral parts are arranged in the form of whorls at the nodes floral leaves or floral parts in a typical flower four floral leaves are present they are calyx corolla andrisia gynesia or pistil all these four parts we can observe in this photograph calyx outermost or first whorl of the flower is called calyx it consists of sepals and these sepals are green or leaf like structures let's see in the photograph so this is a, a flower bud and this green color leaf like structures are called as the sepals these sepals protect the flower bud corolla it is second whorl of the flower it consists of petals petals are brightly colored and may have fragrance or smell so we can see in this photograph this bright colored portion of the flower is called as petals and these petals helps in cross pollination by attracting insects due to presence of bright color and production of fragrance andrisium it is third whorl of the flower andrisium is a male reproductive part of the flower it consists of stamens and each stamen is a modified leaf or microsporophyll each stamen has two parts first one filament it is a long slender stalk that carries food and water to the anther second part anther it is a bi lobed structure present in the tip of the filament anther produces pollen grains or microspores gynesium or pistil it is innermost whorl of the flower gynesium is the female reproductive part of the flower it consists of carpels each carpel has three parts they are stigma topmost part that receives pollen grains during pollination style it forms the neck of the carpel ovary it is a swollen basal part of the carpel it contains one or more ovules these ovules are also considered as future seeds essential floral parts 
फ्लोरल पार्ट विच आर एसेंशियल ड्यू टू फॉर्मेशन ऑफ मेल एंड फीमेल गैमेट्स दे आर एंड्रीशियम गाइनीशियम नॉन एसेंशियल फ्लोरल पार्ट फ्लोरल पार्ट विच आर नॉट इन्वॉल्व इन द फॉर्मेशन ऑफ गैमेट्स दे आर कैलिक्स Corolla complete flower flower with all the floral parts such as calyx corolla andrisium and gynecium such flowers are called as complete flowers examples china rose or hibiscus datura etc incomplete flower flower in which any one of the floral part is absent is called incomplete flower see in this photograph there are two flowers are given female flower and male flower in female flower male reproductive part andrisium is absent in male flower female reproductive part called gynecium is absent examples cucumber papaya etc perianth calyx and corolla together called as perianth okay student and another concept we can discuss in the next part thank you